Well, Dan, public comment just got done, so the city council members are now responding to these protesters who say that these new lease guidelines are unfair for those business owners on the wharf. While so far, many of the city council members have voiced that they are sticking with these guidelines. They say it's what's best for the city. I just don't feel it's right. And so I had to step up, you know, and I'm, I'm happy to do it. Several hundred people marched through downtown Monterey to City Hall to urge city council members to rethink the new lease guidelines that they fear may completely change the local flavor of Old Fisherman's Wharf. Everything on the wharf has been operated by family from the beginning. And so that's what we want to keep the culture. These new lease guidelines mean that businesses that don't renew the leases will be evicted. One business, Ballesteria's Warfront gift shop, already got an eviction notice. Sorry about that. It looks like we had some technical issues, so that full story we'll have later on on Action News at 11. Now, at this point here at the city council meeting, they haven't made any kind of decision, and there really isn't any kind of decision on the table at this time, just because there hasn't been a motion for any kind of change to these guidelines. Now, what could happen is one of these city council members could make a motion for staff to change or improve these guidelines over time, and we'll just have to wait and see. Dan? All right, we'll see where it goes. Thank you very much, Bryn. City manager also adds they have no plans of filling vacant spots on the wharf with outside vendors like chain restaurants, at least for now. They plan to work with existing tenants on the wharf.